But I think Coach Connie, to start with him, is he had a big impact on me just in terms of taking care of my body. I think anyone that knows him knows he's very serious about that. And I can't lie that the fact that I came in here not that serious about it, you know, that wasn't my main thing. And that definitely changed over time. He got me into it. He got me excited about it. And then just having his baseball mind, him playing in professional baseball, playing with the A's, him being around all those things, being able to take what he's learned and show us and have it make sense, uh, stealing bases. He's learned from some of the best, you know. Um, so, and then then Coach Brunson, you know, me and him always got along. He was like a – almost like a big brother to me, you know. He, Me and him go over different pitches, how to, how to maybe change the grip, alter things, uh, slightly fix mechanics-wise, stuff like that. So, it was always like a give and take between us. And we always just like – got along, worked great together. We were able to obviously do great things. So I think it worked out. So I, I just think we had a great relationship. Well, you know, it's it was exciting because not really that my name was getting brought up. It was exciting to kind of relive the experience, you know, because I started following along. Um, I had a couple people. I actually worked with another person who graduated from California University. So they were sending me uh, Twitter handles and it had – all the info about him chasing. He has a chance to break and all that. So I started following along and I know that I, I was reading up and some people were saying, oh, he did it five years. But what that tells me is even though five years, three years, it tells me that he was consistent. He was always there for his team. He competed. He gave them innings. He did exactly what he wanted to do. So I was rooting for him. I, I, I actually was on Twitter and I retweeted a couple of things, you know, giving him good luck because records are made to be broken. And so I, I didn't know. I honestly didn't think that was going to keep standing because I, at the time, I did do it in three years. So I figured it was going to fall, but I'm sure it will here soon. I, I think that one's just a matter of time. Yeah, I want to thank just really. I want to thank everyone at Cal U. There's so many names. You know, that we can get really specific on a few. Is Coach Connie, Coach Brunson. Um, I really want to thank my wife, and maybe not everyone knows this, but I met my wife at Cal. She did not go to Cal. She graduated from Clarion University. But I met her there one night, actually, and ended up marrying her. We've been married for four years now, um, together 10. So, obviously, she's my rock. Um, I would like to thank my parents. They've always been there for me. Obviously, they've given me all the avenues. They've done everything they can to help me succeed as a man. Um, really want to thank uh, – really – just go back to uh, the whole athletic department as well, because when you're at Cal, that's another thing too. When you're there playing, you're kind of like family in the athletic department. You're always around and up there. I, I was always up there talking to you. And so it's kind of like a family there. So I want to thank all you guys too, to make everyone feel comfortable, especially us athletes that come in there and we're away from home and you guys make us feel welcome. So I want to thank you guys too.